what is going on boys and girls happy new year to you and welcome back to another video it's another stock video as you can see i've been busy the last couple of days and i can tell you why i'm excited because there's some exceptional things on here this isn't even everything that i've picked up this week but it's a little selection bit of corgi bit of dinky bit of redline literally something for every budget so let's take on a little look through because i tell you what we kick in 2023 off spectacular is what i'm gonna do right so no plan like every other video we're just going to start at one side and go through, which we're going to start with some 1960s Corgi. These are gorgeous, aren't they? It's like a little Dactari gift set with the three of those together. Love that. That's absolutely awesome. We've got the James Bond here as well. Let me just pop that over. There we go. Stunning condition for a loose model. Fully working. We've got a Gamma Jeep. Right, that's in there. I've just pulled that up because it came with the Hot Wheels. Lovely little condition. Look at the little figures in there. Love that. Awesome little corgi. And through to the back, we've got the mobile gun, which is sealed in the case. We've got some lovely dinkies. Now, out of the dinkies here, the 50s era, to me, is the best era. The, the yellow dinky boxes, that's what you want to see. But also, these American cars, phenomenal. I love them. I personally love them. Right, I'll come back to that one. We've got the helicopter. Lovely example. Mint in the box. We've got the back copter. Lovely example, mint in the box. And underneath here, we've got the gift set three. Let me just move these out of the way carefully. Actually, put that there. There we go. I know you can't see that probably because the instructions are covering the car at the minute, but also the original label badge is still in there, which is nice to have artwork. Come on, check those. Awesome. That's a lovely set. Nice to have. Then we got a little JPS special going on. Lovely in that scale too, awesome. We've got a Polystyl motorbike, which is complete with everything. We got the USS Enterprise, which is also mint in a box, in a packaging. It's got the little flying discs and it's got the stickers still unstuck. So probably about as mint as you will find. Eagle Freighter, what are we saying? Lid has gone a little bit yellow like they do with age, but it's all there, it's still quite solid. It hasn't gone brittle, awesome. Joe's 90, Joe 90 even, sorry. Mint in the box, all original. That's beautiful. What's happening, Joe? That's a good vibe, isn't it? But more importantly for me in this video, I know this is a short, brief one as we go through. It's the red lines. I can tell you what, right? As I'm filming this at the minute, it's midday, right? I've been up already about eight, nine hours because I went and picked up these today and I'm doing it off the bat. Very tired, as you can probably tell. But sometimes you've got to document the moment when the hype is real. And the hype is definitely real. So let's start you with the carded red line. You just don't see them. You really don't see them. Do you know, I got, honest truth, I got into a massive bidding battle for these red lines. But I was winning them no matter what. Because you just don't see them. What about the Porsche and the pink? Oh, honestly, I'm speechless when I look at them. These are cool as well. Some little parachutes. I guess they might be for the bikes. And you've got the Porsche pink or the Porsche in red. Check out the condition on these though, honestly. What a collection. Love that, the beach bombs as well, awesome. That's just, I, do you know what? I'm excited about it, boys and girls. So much so, right? I'm not excited, I'm kind of speechless about it. I've been doing this job 13, 14 years as a business. Um, like some of you might look at this now and yes, it's incredible. Don't get me wrong, but I see this on a weekly basis, probably two or three times over. If you know what I mean, I see a lot of stuff because I buy and sell a lot of stuff. If not, it goes on the eBay store, Instagram, Facebook, or I'll sell it to other dealers. So not often do I like sort of like do a video or just see the stuff in front of me and I am speechless. I don't have the words of what I want to say mostly because of this. It's just mind blowing. You just don't see it. But of course, as per, all of these are for sale. Jordan's Vintage Oil is the eBay store. Check the description of this video or just Google Jordan's Vintage Oil. Facebook it, Instagram it, you'll find it. Um, these are not going to last around long, I'll be honest with you. Um, yeah, don't get me wrong. These, I've had to pay very, very strong money because of the battle, but they're still going to be affordable. And let's be honest, where are you going to find that stuff? You're not. But yeah, this is just a very, very small snippet. Um, I've got some incredible plans coming over the next couple of weeks both with the toy stuff and everything else. So stick around there. If you're just finding me from this video, consider subscribing, yeah? And tell you what, drop it in the comment below. What is your favorite item on this table? I tell you what, that's short and sweet. That's enough teasing because I just want to go and play with them myself. I'll be honest with you. But until next time, explore my boss, Jordan's Vintage World. I'm done. Boosh.
I love that car.